Um, and the reason I bring that up is that I know you've seen very interesting work that, you know, to look at it, you know immediately from any angle, from any distance, that's an unusual guitar. Um, that's not my approach to things. I, uh, I, I envy that. Uh, but, you know, working, uh, working as a designer, working uh, in the industry, you know, uh, consulting, design, whatever, I, my job has always been to, to innovate, but do it in the context of the guitar that people can see and receive immediately as, you know, what's in their brain, as what a guitar looks like. Um, you know, I can pat myself on the back and say, well, maybe that's a higher uh, challenge, you know, than just making something strange or novel or original in every way. I don't know. But that's been my job. And so this guitar is, as you look at it, ah, it's a guitar. You know, it's, it's uh, pretty accessible in that way. Um, in fact, though, this guitar is different in many, many ways. Um, one of the uh, obvious ways is just the architecture of the instrument. The, uh, if you, I'll just hold it like this. If you look at it just straight down the neck and you see the body and everything, you see a number of things at once. You see how the, uh, the neck is offset up above, you know, the plane of the uh, soundboard. And you see that the body is tapered from one side to the other, uh, deeper on the base. I saw somebody brought a guitar this morning who has that same feature, uh, the, which you can, you know, see more clearly perhaps from that. And what isn't necessarily apparent at first is that this uh, this top has a negative pitch to it. Normally, it's the back. It pitches up toward the heel relative to the reference plane, which is the uh, an imaginary plane that sits atop the two end blocks on the soundboard <coughs> surface. Well, the uh, reference plane in this case is the back before I tapered it. <laughs> it. It no longer exists, but it's that to which the sides are squarely bent. And the top pitches, like the back normally does, it pitches down instead of the back pitching up. And that has a lot to do with uh, this, the elevation here. Uh, 